We are into April 2019. March is left behind, yet the lurking effects of March Mercury retrograde has left us completely shaken. Not only you guys, but even I was shaken up to the core. Luckily for us, when April is technical, that is it's full of the retrograde planets of Saturn, then we have Pluto and we have Jupiter retrograde. To top it all, we have a conjunction of Jupiter, Ketu with Saturn. So we should consider ourselves fortunate that Mercury turned direct on March 28th. And in spite of all the foibles, all the flaws, all the rattling experiences we have all gone through, we should be wise enough to know that even in April, we need to keep our reins correct. We need to completely hold on to our horses, be resilient and laugh it off, thinking that life has never been easy and now it is a challenge to be patient, to be keeping quiet, especially when conjunction of Jupiter and Ketu with Saturn is there and out of these three planets, Jupiter is retrograde, Saturn is retrograde. Saturn wants you to think correct, Jupiter wants you to expand and Ketu is showing us those carrots and illusions. How well we know ourselves is what we need to take care, how well we are aware how much patience we have or how much resilience we have or how much capability we have of laughing it off and saying this too shall pass because Saturn is going to definitely test us big time. So we need to be correct, we need to be determined, we need to be resilient, we need to be de um, dedicated. Above all, we need to have a purity of intent intact. It's going to be difficult but not impossible. Well, the month of April 2019 for you Taurus, uh, it foretells that you will have total control over your personal life as well as your social life. You will be in a favorable position to make developments in your life as well as direct your life in the direction that you want. It will uh, now the Taurus zodiac sign basically is of great physical and health state and hence you will be able to make corrections in your in your part of life that went wrong previously in your love uh, relationships well uh, according to me your love life at this moment will include a lot of disagreements which can be solved amicably through discussions and reach a mutual understanding now since you have the ability to actually handle your turbulent social life also you must take steps to meet your friends and spend some time with them and you need to take baby steps and if you feel that there is any kind of an instability coming, then either sort it out or probably have a rethought about who are acquaintances in life and who are actually friends. Because Taurus do not have the ability, they think their acquaintances are all their friends. So you need to understand the difference between acquaintances and friends. In regards to your family relationships at this juncture, it's actually at a very lousy state due to strong understanding, uh, sorry, misunderstanding among family uh, members. So either um, uh, spend some time with them or better still my advice is because the planets are retrograde, keep away sort them out softly and amicably or probably try to understand what they want. Actually 100% every individual is undergoing their own mental frame of mind. So understanding them will also become confusing because they will not be able to help you out that way. So it's better to be non-intrusive. Now you will receive actually many blessings from the elders of your family and what they will have to do is to disengage yourself from a confrontation of any sort for the strong bond to continue. So do not um, argue or do not get into any kind of confrontation with the elders and the blessings will come automatically. If you um, tend to oppose them or if you feel that you are not actually um, uh, in, in, in the same speaking, the same uh, uh, thoughts or the same lines what they want, then just hear them out and probably you can tell your word next month. 
Now, according to your health, you will have a superb health status this time of the year and your spiritual being will also have grown stronger. The Taurus zodiac sign will have to strengthen your muscles to maintain good health. So you need to do a lot of toning up because Taurus is very fond of eating their food. So burning it out is also important. According to your career, well, your career development will be hyped up this month and every attempt in a job search will be successful. And that all favors your workplace also because people will get up and recognize your potential and talents. In regards to your finance, this uh, month reveals that you will have bright monetary status as well as well as a very financially developed mind. So the month of April also reveals that financially you will do very well. In fact, uh, strange though it may seem, uh, seem but your financial mind is also working in the correct way. And you have a lot of potential when it comes to investments in the month of April. This will in turn bring greater fortune for the future. So do not hesitate to do the investments. In regards to people who are involved with education, it predicts that though you have dull expectations this time of the year when it comes to studies, you will have to put extra effort and hard work to attain your educational goals, whichever course you take. So nothing comes easy for you Torians. In regards to your travel, in case if you're planning to travel, it neither favors nor disfavors. So you need to just be prudent. Your business or self-planned travels will have a lower possible probability or possibility uh, of it being a success. But if you can postpone them, it is the right time to postpone them and do things later on. But if you cannot postpone it, don't expect but yet it's a, um, there's a very good saying where we say hope for the best but be prepared for the rest. So this is what you need to do if you're traveling out for your business. In all a month of patience and again resilience, again not being confrontational to the elders and where young ones are concerned, well you needn't be intrusive, you just need to be patient and explain to them so that there is no bad energy around. It will take a lot out of you to keep the negative energies at bay but then you have no choice, you got to do it. Definitely in all this halabu for your best days, for your intense days, for your stressful days, whether you will have days for love and money and honey, you will have to visit my website. And now to know more about yourself so that you are fully aware of which are the parts of your life that needs correctness. What is it that you need to do because this is definitely a time for most of us to get corrections done in our life, to get the wrong right and to actually look into us and um, into yourselves and um, feel for yourself where are the things that are going wrong why are they going wrong and to top it all you need to know what you want to do how you are going to do it and why you should do it for that you need to have an awareness of your personal natal chart and look into your birth analysis to know what your profile is to know what your professional and personal traits are and how you can make the best of it. For that, get into your natal charts. If not made, it's time now to get your personalized natal chart made so that life can be taken in your hands and you can be an architect of your own fate.